Yeah, you're all right, guys and girls, welcome back. So I've just come back not long ago. I'd say a couple of minutes ago. Uh, this is day 948 days into my slim fast dieting plan. Video log 1905 episodes. 1905 episodes. So I'm just um, doing my mum's uh, dinner right now. And I'll be right back in a sec. This is my breakfast episode. And I'm doing mine as well. Right, you guys and girls. So I'm almost finished doing this. So I'm just doing my mum's jacket to put that in there for an extra four minutes. So doing her jacket potato. And then we have put that in for four minutes. And then we can get through the chopper. Right, uh, oh, here we go. Uh, right, oh, God, let me see. So it's open. Got to open it with a tin opener. Oh, my. All right. All right. All right. Now let's go around. Yeah, I just had to get that long bus. It took nearly like two hours to get back uh, home and all that. Got the Clevedon, well, the bus from the bus station to Clevedon, and it goes through to the town and all that, uh, to Tesco's, and drops us off and all that. And I was like, my God. Whew, a long way. Nearly two hours in total. Right, that one for an extra four minutes. Anyway, so I'm going to finish this episode off, but before I do, for my breakfast episode, I had my slim fast this morning. Actually, I've got a few unboxing videos. I went to see Axel in Bristol today as well, because I do my a uh, lot of my um, videos. When I buy certain things, I'll upload them, do like sort of a review on them. Anyway, got my Slim Fast uh, Dieting Shake right here. Summer Strawberry Flavoured Shake. No added sugar, scientifically proven plan of weight loss. High protein, 15 grams of protein, 230 calories, source of fiber, 23 vitamins and minerals. Absolutely delicious. And I recommend it. Also added a little bit of my grey and black hot chocolate, absolutely delicious, organic, and soya, light, added some of that, but I've got some coconut today. My god, I went into Starbucks today as well. By god, amounts of people piling up, and like, it was, it's kind of slow service in there, what you can compare with uh, Costa's, uh, for instance. I, and to be honest, I felt really like a traitor today when I went into uh, Starbucks. I mean, don't get me wrong, the coffee was absolutely nice. The, well, the chocolate was hot chocolate, soya, with soy milk in it. Uh, nothing else in it, because I'm vegan, so I just have it plain. Add the hot chocolate in there. Absolutely delicious and hot and all that. But the service, like, took nearly ages. I don't know what it is, they had about four or five people in there going up and down doing stuff behind the counter and getting all the drinks but I thought um, their service seemed lacking behind a little bit then what you do with Costas, you go in there with Costas, they have the drinks already um, and then just go in there and collect it and that's it, done. No complaints. But with Starbucks it seemed to be a bit different but the coffee's nice actually, the hot chocolate I should say, is quite nice. But anyway, guys and girls, I'm going to finish off this episode here. I'll be back in a minute. 
with my next episode. Anyway, cheers all for watching. Stay safe, guys and guys, and I'll see you on the next episode. It is today, Thursday 9th of August 2018, and it's 10.18. Apparently, in Bristol right now, or just outside of Bristol, they've got the hot air balloons on, I think, to midnight. And they're doing them from the 9th of August all the way up to the 12th of August. So they're having this sort of uh, festival. Um, I don't know if it's free to get in and I don't know if it's actually uh, able enough for people with wheelchairs. Unless it's all on grass or something. but uh, Or unless they've got a patio or a pathway to go through. But um, I'll probably leave that for the time being. Probably do some research in that and probably go next year uh, for the festival. But anyway guys and girls, cheers for watching. Stay safe.